Hello, this is Bern, and if you're interested in figuring out if a guy that you're interested in is relationship ready, stick around because I'll be sharing with you how to find out in our episode today. Hello, this is Bern. Welcome to your great life tv.com. Today is another edition of Get the Love You Crave, and I'm super excited to be sharing with you how to find out if a guy that you're interested in that you're starting to date is relationship ready, relationship minded, commitment minded, however you're gonna call it, and stop wasting your time, okay? I'm gonna give you six signs for you to know that the guy is on the right track of being the kind of man that you wanna spend a lot of time with. The first one is super simple, it's clear pursuit. What does that mean? That means that the guy's intentions towards you are not a mystery. He is very clear, very straightforward, he likes you, he wants to connect with you, and he's actually doing shit to make it happen. He's figuring things out, he's understanding what you want, and he is planning ahead and making uh, connections with you. So, first one is super simple, but you'd be surprised how many women get caught up into the whole mystery of, I don't know if this guy likes me or not, I don't know what his intentions are, that's not usually a guy who wants to be in a relationship. That's typically a guy who wants to play games or a guy who wants to enjoy you energetically but not really willing to put in the price of making it happen. Second one is he has a professional approach. What do I mean by that? I don't mean that he's professional and he's robotic way of connecting with you. I mean that if, think about it this way, if you were going to a job interview, would you get there late or would you arrive five minutes early? Well, five minutes early. He's doing that. If you uh, can't be there for some reason and you say, I'm gonna call you at this time, like the guy wants to connect with you and says, I'm gonna call you on Tuesday, and he can't call you because he's in a meeting, he'll take the five seconds it takes of consciousness and uh, clarity to say, hey, I can't connect with you right now, I'll call you tomorrow or I'll call you tonight, but he doesn't leave you hanging and necessarily feeling anxious for no reason at all. So he's being professional, he's treating you with the same respect and the same professionalism he would take something that he's really interested in in his career, okay? Number three, he's unafraid to plan. And unafraid to plan means that he's not only unafraid to plan the next outing, the next date, the next connection, but when you connect with him, he's already thinking about things he wants to do. There's a specific movie that he loves and he wants to share it with you and he's talking to you about it. There's a place that he enjoys, a restaurant he loves, a city he wants to visit with you. And he's creating those plans and planting those seeds and letting you know that he's thinking ahead. You know the guy is interested in a relationship when he's not just thinking about the present, he's thinking about the future and he's very clear. He's not scared about telling you. His intentions are sent in terms of the future when he's connecting with you, okay? Number four is he doesn't play games. Why is this so important? Because so many guys, for example, get upset and instead of telling you, you know what, that pissed me off, let's talk about it, or I prefer if you did this, things this way, or whatever it is that's important to communicate, if he's the kind of guy who's going to pretend nothing happened and then play a little guilt trip or stop calling you for a couple of days so you appreciate him more. If he's doing that kind of shitty, <laughs> uh, immature kind of game, that's a guy that even if he wants to be in a relationship, he is not relationship ready. He's a guy who's, again, playing games, <laughs> right? Number five, he prioritizes you in his life in a good way. So he's not making you the number one thing in his life, but he's certainly not making you the last thing in his life. If you connect to a guy who has a lot of qualities but always has a freaking excuse why he can't see you, why he can't connect with you, why something showed up at the last minute, why he has this big meeting, a guy who has an amazing life will have stuff going on but regardless of what's going on, he's going to find some time to give you time and to be generous with his energy with you. Don't ever buy into the BS story of a guy telling you, I don't have time for this. If he wants it, he will make time. I don't care if he's the president of the United States or if he's a guy who is the CEO of five companies. If he's really interested in you, he will make the time to connect with you. So never buy into that BS of there's not enough time. He has time to connect if he wants to. Number six is he loves to share you with his inner world and his outer world. So what I mean by that is here's a guy who feels proud to connect with you. So when you're walking in the street, he, he feels happy to people, for people to see you together. He wants for you to meet his friends. 
he wants for you to connect with his co-workers, he is happy to introduce you, He's, he lights up at the thought and the notion of more people around him knowing that you two are connected. When you have a guy who exhibits one or two or three or four of this, the more of these traits that he exhibits, the more clear you, the more clarity you have that he's a guy who means business and who's ready for a relationship with you. The theory of the science that he exhibits, the more you know you're in fantasy land with this man and that even though if it, even if it feels connected, even if it feels amazing, even if it feels spiritually blissful, he's not someone that long-term has what it takes to connect with you. If you find this is helpful, insightful, useful, I'm going to ask you to do three things. Number one, click like on this video. Number two, subscribe to my channel. Number three, most important of all, if you don't do anything else, on the description of this video or on the screen right here, you'll see a button or a link that allows you to sign up for my free live webinar that's going to give you a blueprint to find your soulmate in 90 days or less. Super powerful stuff and it's free. If you have any questions for me, place a comment on this video. Tell me what you think about this. Ask me anything you want and I'll reply personally. And as always, I challenge you to live a full and a conscious life.